Here I want to show you my homemade espresso machine. This is basically um, a Rancilio Silvia that uh, I have taken apart, used some of it. See the internals here. You can see down here. I've got um, a Siemens logo PLC uh, to control the, the machine and how it brews. I have here a PID controller for the uh, boiler temperature for the espresso. Um, we have the standard Ulka pump. Uh, this is um, the water tank. It can be taken out. I have a back plate for this, so normally this is not to be taken out. You will fill the water from above. I have made uh, a steam boiler. This in here all has been isolated as good as possible. Hot water. You have to turn it on for the hot water to come out. Standard Sylvia handle, standard Sylvia group head. This pressure brew button, uh, as you saw, the water button, have to open, and the uh, steam boiler. Heat button. Uh, I have installed a no burn steam arm. Plus, uh, and it gives a um, pretty good steam. A um, manometer where I can see. the pressure in the steam boiler also it is uh, temperature controlled on pressure stat and not on temperature so I have adjusted it for uh, two bars it should uh, give about 120 degrees celsius um, because I have built in the, the, the logo PLC controller, I've been able to um, make some programming, which actually means that if I want to fill my steam boiler with water, I just uh, yeah, it's too much pressure. But that's filling up. I have made an, a program for auto back flush. So if I do like that, it will run a back flush program. I was a little bit annoyed about the, the size of the drip tray in the standard Sylvia. So I have made a drip tray with one liter capacity. And that uh, that is enough, I should say. My um, grinder.
Malkonic wire. I will show you um, an espresso shot on my machine. And auto switch off. It wasn't me, it was the PLC. Nice microphone, could have been better, but it's hard with just one hand. I think it is running um, nice, same size as, as a Sylvia and uh, dual boiler, PID, programmable. <laughs> 